Hey there friends. Today I want to show you a really quick tutorial video on how to reset this RS uh, surfboard uh, modem router combination. You can see there is my model number uh, down there, but this is going to work very similar for any models uh, of the RS surfboards. Now the reset button may be in a different spot depending on which model you have. Uh, but again, most of the time with these RS surfboards, you're going to find the reset button on the back. Now I'm going to be, re you can see it's not plugged into uh, the internet right now. I'm actually going to be returning this just because we found a better solution. And so I want to reset this uh, to its default settings so that none of our passwords or anything like that are, uh, are held uh, in here internally. So the reset button you can find is basically right up here on top. And uh, what you're going to do is you're going to use a single uh, tiny, you know, obviously pointed instrument. I actually am going to be using my iPhone SIM card key. Uh, I find that that actually works perfectly for these kind of uh, applications. So what we're going to do is actually take this key and we're going to push it in here. And I'm going to push and I'm going to hold for 15 seconds. It's been about 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Now, once I release, you can see if you were seeing that blue light that was internally there, that actually disappeared. Let's flip this back around, and you can see I just have that power button on now, which means it's cycling back on. So we're going to let that cycle really quick, and that actually is all you need to do to reset to the default settings. You, the lights have fully cycled, Wi-Fi is back on. Again, there's no uh, internet connection here but our Wi-Fi is enabled so I can access the uh, BIOS inside of here now. So let me jump on the computer and show you that. Okay, so we're on uh, my computer, my laptop now, and I'm gonna go ahead and log into the admin portion of the router. And to do that, uh, we first need to make sure we connect to the router's Wi-Fi. So I'm gonna come up here, and this is the name of my specific uh, Wi-Fi router. And it requires a password. This is a good reason why you should always keep the original paperwork that came with your, your modem. I'm going to type in the password that uh, came with ours here. And again, this is the default password. Okay, and that's going to connect as you can see. All right, and we've connected. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to need to open up a Chrome uh, or other web application browser. So let me open up Chrome here. Okay, so now we are inside Chrome. I'm going to go straight to the uh, basically the admin IP address, which is, and this is going to be the same for all routers. Type in 192.168.0.1 and hit enter. Okay, once we are in the RS admin interface software here, I'm actually going to just click on device status. And as you can see up here, these are back to the original configuration, uh, meaning that the Wi Fi names and passwords that I set up have been reset to default. So I hope that helps friends. Again, that's a really quick way of resetting your router and modem combination for this specific RS. Uh, yeah, hope that's helped. You guys have a great day. Hit that subscribe button and uh, we'll have a lot more tips, tricks, and tutorial videos coming up real soon. Take care.